Welcome to the Dogman Channel. We're out here getting some burning done. Perfect condition. Uh, it rained. A real nice, slow drizzle. I was able to get it started before it started raining, and uh, everything is wet. So we don't have any fear of this jumping out of the fire pit. Got actually two fire pits going. This one's being a little stubborn on me down here. Let's go down here and check it out. And we're going to try to get some cleanup done today. Got a lot of that cleared out already. Still got a pile there. Uh, so, well, you know, once you get it burning, it doesn't take long to drag these out. And that's what we're doing. Trying to get this one started back up. It's been raining off and on. We'll just try to try to go with it. This one, I had this thing blazing earlier. <laughs> I mean, it was going. But I had a great big pile of stuff there, if y'all remember. That's gone. Got all that stuff burned up. That's gone. What you doing? You're in Arkansas. You don't got to make wind. I do today. I don't know what. It's crazy. It's cray cray. Now let's go drag some more stuff. This ain't going to be the whole video, guys. I'm just filming. Uh, actually, I'm just filming on the tail end of filming the walking video. So you're going to see that in the walking video if you watch it. All right, let's drag some of this out. See, it looks like it's more than it actually is. Now, when you throw something on the fire, you got to do this. You say, get on my job. See there? All right. Let's go grab another. Maybe I'll take some down of that one. Got these little pesky vines that keep sticking to me. All right, let's grab another big one. That's like a good part of that pile. Oh yeah. This will help cover that. All right, guys. Get on! Yeah. What are you guys complaining about over there? We hear the tractor. All right, guys, I'm gonna cut this off for a minute and get this stuff going. All right, man, there used to be like 50 logs there. Yeah, they've been sitting there. There ain't no more. We were blaring the fire. Been at it a few hours, guys. We got a lot cleaned up around here. Let me go get the rest of them. Y'all can watch. Maybe appear a little dark on the camera. I'm gonna get some more in there. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. 
Mama said there'd be fires like this. There'd be fires like this. My mama said, yes she did, yes she did. Look at that. It's just peaceful out here. Mama said there'd be flies like this, and if there wasn't, you could really blast them with. Eat your heart out, devil. I can make some fire. Watch that for a few minutes. Then I got another chore. I gotta go get the shovel. Yeah, I'll just sit there and watch that for a minute. I gotta go fetch a shovel. Don't go nowhere. Man, I wish they would shut that compressor off over there across the road. That aggravates the liver out of me. All night long that thing goes. It's like, it's like they live to irritate me. I ain't kidding. This ain't what I got the shovel for. All right, y'all seen the fire enough. Let's go. I'm just gonna hoist you up like that. All right. A couple years ago, there was a big pine. You can see the stump over there by the, see those milk jugs? Yeah, that thing was the biggest tree on the property. And it's down. And this right here is the last of it. And this stuff just disintegrates. So what I'm gonna do with the rest of this, this is what I've been throwing in the fire. Just chop it up, man. It's good worm stuff right there. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, that one ain't so wet in the fire. Get y'all back a little bit. Let me go throw this one in the fire. You like my duty in uh, Waldo? You like my duty? Oh, you got a little bit of that been sitting here about two years. To the fire with you. Too hard to break up. The breaking up is hard to do. over here and check on the waddles. Well, there's a few pieces of wood I could burn waddles. Are you still telling these girls about your near-death experience? Oh my goodness. He's not going to forget about that. All right, waddles. You had an NDE. Yeah. Here's that tree I was talking about. There ain't a lot left of this. Let them sit a couple years, man. They just really go downhill. I can get the pickaxe and go after this. and Another year, he won't even know this was here probably if I left it alone. 
you were almost ready to go for your walk. Yeah, you didn't you didn't get to come out most of the day because it was raining. But you're gonna get to go for a walk. Yeah, we're gonna get to go. It has just been a nasty, nasty day. About 38 degrees, but wet and clammy and cold. Huh? We'll go for our walk. All right. I am happy with the progress of today. And I am even going to start tackling this junk pile. Get it hauled off to the uh, junkyard. So I need this room back here, man. I want to make a lean-to back here. Oh, all this is stuff that was picked up from the property. There's, a, <laughs> there's an old door I've been, a window I've been saving. I don't know why. A couple old doors. But all this could be hauled away. It's mostly scrap metal. But I'm not going to get nothing for it in this town. We don't even have a scrap metal place. Man, look at this, guys. I gotta take this pine tree down. I mean, it's probably hard to tell. That thing's dead. Yeah. Big old sucker, but it's a little bitty around. I'll just notch it over here, put it down over there, but I don't want to bring it down until I get the rest of this mess out of here. And there is a lot of it. <sighs> These tires, I can take them to Waldron to the transfer station for two dollars a piece i can get rid of them there's nothing i want to use them for here i've heard all the ideas i don't want my stuff growing in nasty old tires and this tractor tire i just hauled over here i might throw some dirt in there and plant something in there who knows i don't know why i even brought this one home from the ranch but it did yep so I did a lot of this work on uh, my walking video this morning, but there's still a whole lot in here needs to be taken out. Uh, that fire pit never did produce well today, or reduce well. But I've got a lot of them picked up in here. I'm gonna get the uh, the brush cutter, get the rest of this cut out. There ain't a whole lot of it left here in the center. And we'll have this cool little island here and uh, get the rest of this chopped down it's these vines man they make it so hard they are everywhere they make it so hard to clear brush but i'm picking away at it a little at a time if i can get some more done i'll be happy all right let's go see the progress of this fire might as well i'll never not come over there empty-handed huh This stuff's burning down pretty good. That old ladder I built never was any good. Watch them. You know, you get so much of this wood laying around, there's just, you can't recycle everything. At some point, you gotta get rid of it. That's what I'm gonna do. Got a big pile there, burned up. All that that was piled over here is gone. So, I made a lot of progress today. Alright, All right, we're getting Libby out for her nightly walk. You don't want to go back by that fire, do you? Uh, you got to go where she wants to go. She's not easy to walk. She's not easy for nothing. No, nope, she ain't easy to do nothing with. Hey, hey, hey. Sometimes you just got to stop and take control. You go down this trail. Oh, this one. She's more trouble than 50 dogs put together. I ain't kidding you guys. She is a tough one. She's lucky that I got her. Because not a lot of people would deal with her. I knew she was a problem dog when I got her. That's why I got her. But she's had a good, good eight years she wouldn't have had. She's almost, let me see, I got her in 15, yeah, November of 15, so seven, I've had her seven years, she was a year and a half when I got her, so she's almost nine, give her some privacy, and she's a real, she's a sweetheart, but she can be stubborn, and I, I believe me, I don't want to keep her the way she's kept in a kennel but she don't get along with nobody else 
and she bites people so i have to you know <laughs> what do you do if i didn't have rooster in the and i have tried her in the house before i got rooster she she tears everything up i mean i fell asleep she had cords chewed up you know this breed is not meant to be inside not saying you couldn't she just ain't she likes being outside anyway come on Lib, let's go down and check out the trails now that i got them cleared then we're going to sign off on this video you got to sniff everything this is why i don't walk her on my morning walks because she's got to stop every two minutes i'd never get any kind of exercise all right let's go all right guys we'll go ahead and end it here uh wasn't really no theme to today's video it's just a video i'm waiting for my morning video to upload that takes forever because i always upload those in 4k and it's only at 52 percent so if you see this it's probably late at night or in the morning all right guys we'll see you on the next one happy trails now you're walking nice that's melly's poop yeah let's walk around that You rock my world Baby, you You rock my world Like no one else You make it spin and twirl Baby, you You rattle my chain What happened? Did you guys fall? <laughs> ah, ah.